I already know that. I just wanted to look like a tan goddess in the roads of Florence, Italy. It'll calm, it'll simmer down. I have to wash it off still. I'm just gonna smell like a baked potato when I'm on the flight for 12 hours. So me and Gabby, we're go flying into Florence, Italy. We're just gonna explore and just figure it out as we go. So stay tuned for this amazing trip. It's gonna be so fun. Tan is still developing. I look like a crazy person. A few issues coming here. My fault. Gabby put in the wrong address, so we basically drove in a half an hour in traffic for no reason. And then we had to pay for our, our bags, and there was just a little bit of miscommunication. Me and Gabby have a road all to ourselves. Are you kidding? turned on the little mermaid and we got free wine which is literally insane we never experienced that before and the little mermaid we didn't enjoy that much then we also got served some dinner which was pretty darn good we changed the movie because the little mermaid sucked and we put on priscilla honestly i feel like this entire flight was just them feeding us food which is literally my dream swiss airlines 10 out of 10. Switzerland. Yeah, I'm just looking forward to taking a nice shower once we arrive. Welcome to my crib. Okay, before we start this MTV crib, we just want to say that it did look nicer in the photos. <laughs> The kitchen. Well, as you can see here, we have this, which is falling off. <laughs> I just like it because it adds a little bit of character. Um, host was generous enough to leave us two espresso. Not one, two. two. One for each of us. We have the stove, the oven, what looks to be some grease splatters right here. And then we open these pretty windows and we have, it, we have a nice view. Honestly, oh, look like a little volleyball court down there. Boom. So moving on to the bathroom. Another accent. I like the ads character. The duck team. <laughs> oh, this is oh nice I love this mirror. So we have this nice little sink situation. The shower is pretty nice. Um, we are once again with the weird toilet situation. Which we have two toilets. Oh, they left us. So That's nice. Some shampoo and conditioner. One roll of toilet. Oh shoot. One roll. We're gonna have to get some. Why don't they supply that? That's annoying. They say that and then they give us one. Okay, anyways. Abstract design. This is where... <laughs> um, they should have put a, maybe a fresh coat of paint on the walls. She did say that she left us that for mosquitoes, so that's generous of her. Well, yeah, Sounds that's like nice. Sounds like a little bit of from the station. <laughs> uh, yeah. Dining. Um, this is like, okay, I like this area. Yeah, who buys a purple couch? The couch is horrendous. With cactus green pillows. Um, but this is a spacious room. I don't know if I think the, uh, the purple and the red are not really meshing well together. Okay, picture central for sure. And here's our outside view. The streets of Florence. I will say there is a lot of construction happening, so there's like fencing everywhere. Okay, we're gonna need some breakfast, so I got some yogurt. We got these noodles too. Thai sweet chili, like ramen. Yogurt. Got these espresso pods. This bread. Put olives in it. Okay, also got two types of crackers because me and Gabby are gonna make a little um, like cheese board tonight. Balsamic. Toilet and paper. Olive oil. Some jam for the crack. Lemon yogurt. A bottle opener. Uh, oh, yep, they do have one. Tomatoes. Obviously, a and I got some meat. 
basil and burrata. I got these hazelnut little cracker things for a treat. Got a thing of water. Mm -hmm. and we, got, we got a red mm -hmm. wine, a sparkly. Mm -hmm. um, we wanted to get some champagne to pop. Three, yep. Three, two, one. Because I kind of lifted it. I don't it think up. so. Bartender. First, a Pervito experience did not go the most smooth. We just started walking down the street from our place and ran into this area. Looks super cute. There's like flashing lights, whatever. We stopped here because we saw people sitting outside. I make a mistake. I'm going to the door, which I thought was the door, but they're so close together. There's this door, which we went into, <laughs> and this is literally the other door. And so I and they're all was, different places. I thought it was the same restaurant. Not the same. Not the same. <laughs> so we, ordered a, we had to order a whole bottle. That's the other thing. There was only a whole bottles, but it's pretty good. No, it's delicious, of course. And then we're gonna get dinner after this somewhere. I don't know where we even are right now. We me and Gabby felt obligated to order an appetizer, so here we got it. it looks so good. What is that, though? It looks like literal diarrhea. <laughs> He's like a Salisbury steak. <laughs> I'm not sure what it, it quite is. <laughs> it feels like a Salisbury steak. With like a little fishy taste to it. That was such a good fling. First of all, we're having a great experience here so far, I will say. This bottle though, are we kidding? This is a wine bottle. The waiter told me to thank him hard. <laughs> if you're visiting Florence, come here. The vibes are great. <laughs> Cheers. Follow her, guys, please. <laughs> Follow me. <laughs> what was that? Bay leaf. Just like, just like bay leaf. Bay leaf? Yes. What do those taste like? These are those cream leaves you put in the ragu. Okay. Like you don't know them? Huh? Earthy? Like what? Earthy. Earthy. She's like cinnamon. This is like a bay leaf. You know what a bay leaf tastes like? I know what a bay leaf is. That tastes like dirt. It tastes like a leaf. That tastes like cinnamon, like sugar. Yes, but I'm walking. What's your name? Andreas, what is yours? Say that again. Gabriella. <laughs> She's laughing. Then you said Gabriella. <laughs> Morning, everyone. We're making espresso. It's noon, by the way. We need it because it's literally noon and we just woke up. Look at how good I slept. You can see because I have lines all over me. We have drank literally like three bottles of wine last night. I had a million shots. <laughs> so that's what happened. We bought these yesterday. Look at, they're too big. Oh yeah, so there's like a schoolyard right here. Like, is that a school? Gosh, I'm so excited to eat this bread today. <laughs> I'm trying this coffee yogurt. Okay, everyone, we got our shit together. And here's an OOTG. Got this shirt from the thrift store. Got these pants from the thrift store. Got these shoes from Free People, their Reebok. Shein, Shein, Mom's Closet. Um, this is a watch from Nordgreen. Yeah, basically everything I own is cheap and from the thrift store. Feel about high when you're on my side. High up in the sky. We're outside of the
outside of Vicio Palace. We ran into this cute little spot with cute tablecloths, so we had to stop. <laughs> like, that's literally what attracted us. Okay, guess what I got, everyone? Yup, an espresso martini from Italy. And it's so good. I didn't try the first sip on camera, but it is literally so fresh, so delicious. Gabby got her first April spritz. Hangover hit us. So that's why I have to rejuvenate myself with an espresso martini. This squeeze is Gabby recommended. Also, this espresso martini has literally rejuvenated my soul. Like, I literally see clearer. Look at, just look. Okay, bye. What do you rate your appetizer you just had? It's so fresh, so good. I would rate it 10 out of 10. Wow. About, what about your drink? Um, Okay. I think I just think the Aperol flavor, like that's not my flavor palette, but I like it. Like it's good. I literally give us a ten out of ten just because of how it's making me feel. That is my great great grandfather. Yep. And that one over there is. Uh, Who's that guy? He is my other uncle. <laughs> okay. I'm just the map wizard and I'm leading us wherever we go today. <laughs> We're kind of like walking on this random road. We don't have Wi-Fi, so we can't look up where anything is. So I just look at the map and then kind of just walk wherever I see. My nose is like, <sighs> my nose is super runny today. I don't know why, so I'm blowing it with a leaf. Aperol spritz in Italy. I tried Gabby's, but here we go. Taste test. We climbed the top of this like literal mountain, but Gabby didn't want to, but I forced her to because she was tired and had to go to the bathroom. I'm confused, like, is that for cigarettes or is that where I dump this? No, that's for six. Don't do that. They served us little olives, olives chips, and I'm gonna try these. Cheers. <laughs> okay, we're gonna throw a, a penny in this little koi pond. Yeah, let's take a wish. Penny. Cheers. First taste. Mm -hmm. So we meant to get a Florentine steak. We ended up getting um, <laughs> this. Beans and something. Pasta? Some pasta. Not sure what it is, but we just, I guess, miscommunication. Is it good though? Mm -hmm. Let's try. I don't know what this is. I just know it was like. Is that a though I'm really scared to eat it. <laughs> octopus, is it? Is it? I'm like actually terrified. We made our first gelato stop. I got flavored cookies. I also got pistachio. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. We're back in our room. Walked probably like seven miles, we're thinking, maybe more. We ate dinner or whatever at this place we didn't really even want to go to, but we couldn't get reservations anywhere else. Yeah, so we tried to order a Florentine steak. We ended up ordering um, a random pasta. Well, this wasn't a random pasta. We didn't know what it was. It was cow intestines. We literally ate cow intestines for dinner. It literally made me sick to my stomach, so we ate it all though. 